welcome to the bathroom. That's just Katie Finch, everybody. <laughs> so I soak my nuts. <laughs> Like really nice stuff. So um, we're gonna go in. Sure, we sure we can talk. I can really honestly tell you that Kitty is badass. How did zero waste come into your life? After Molly and I met, we um, I had massive changes in my life. I, I left my corporate job, and um, I just started becoming like more aware. It was, it's like once you start kind of looking inwards and actually working out what, what's going on, are you happy, are you choosing to be unhappy, you then start noticing more and that's where it started for me. Question your decisions, question what's going on, absorb as much information as possible so you can make decisions that feel like you're making an informed decision. Let's talk to everybody about why it's zero waste and not recycling. I think you're recycling and you're doing a good thing but actually it can't be recycled that many times and all of a sudden you're like, well hang on, where's it going? Yeah, where's it going? And it's going to landfill, but that we're seeing it in the oceans. And that's not because someone's made a mistake, you know, that it's ending up there because there's too much. The way that the course is set up, it's over eight weeks and each week is going to be focused on a different area of your life. Retailers you can use, DIY projects, you know, whichever, however involved you want to get with this. Maybe you just want to buy things, maybe you want to make your own. The reason why this course came about is because for me to transition to zero waste, or as close to zero waste as is, I think, possible, I had to do a lot of research. There is a lot of information out there, but it's not really readily available, it's hard to digest, you know, it's really hard to find. And so I thought, well, why do you have to spend all your time? I've done it already. So the idea being that I can give you already made most of the stuff you would need to replace your bathroom, your kitchen, or whichever area of your life we're talking about without you having to trawl through Google or trawl through the internet and try and find things and work it out. Mm -hmm. You could, there is enough information over the eight weeks for you to make a full transition but there is no expectation that you have to. If you want to take your time, it's taken me, yeah, a, a year to transition as close as possible. And, and be mindful of being too obsessed by the concept zero waste. Mm -hmm. Zero waste actually isn't possible, but what we're talking about is predominantly a circular economy. So rather than something coming in, something going out, you are always think challenging yourself on maybe buying something second hand, reusing something and repurposing things. So keeping everything contained rather than this, I'll take this and then I'll throw it out. So, you know, be mindful of the concept of zero waste and remember that Zen for zero waste. It's not this stressful, militant, you must be zero waste. If you desire to be zero waste, the eight week course is designed so you can get fully there. But if you don't, and it takes you a year, takes you two years, five years, who cares? The most important thing is you're making a difference and even one thing that you do is making a difference.